Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4, No Trail of Tears, our Cherokee Iron Man campaign. Uh, so, we are currently at war with a whole load of people. Um, now, I've kind of broken the uh, a, a rule you should try and play by in most war games, is that I stopped play. I had to stop in the middle of a war. So, I'm just now starting a new recording session. Um, apologies for uh, not having videos, I think for like the last week or so, um, in this series. But, I got busy and couldn't find a good time to record this series. So, yeah. But we're back, and we're going to try and continue on. Um, we're not in a great state right now. Uh, the fox is sieging down our capital. We have just... We are retreating up to the Huron to recover our army, which we don't have enough manpower for. So that's going to be fun. I'm going to have to figure something out there. Might have to hire a couple mercenaries. I would rather not, though. But we'll have to... We'll see. Uh, the one good news is we do have the Fox being sieged down. So hopefully in 11 days, the Fox will lose their capital. We can piece them out and stop the siege on our capital without too much trouble but we'll have to wait and see on that so without further ado let us continue on and hopefully we can win this war i guess all right let's unpause and see what happens all right nothing major we are working on going we're only on two speed we just hit some natives unfortunately it's not good all right now get out before they get up there Get up to the rest of the army, join up, and then probably try and siege down Patuani. Um, this is the actual the Patuani's army, so fighting them here might not be a bad idea. But we'll see. Get there on the 23rd. He moves up there. They are not coming after us, which is great. So now I just need to let my army recover a little bit. Hope that the fox gets sieged down before they siege me down nope and they are making progress this isn't this is not going very well for me um, people spying on me uh, here comes the Huron army which is great they can hopefully beat some people up I am getting siege down by more Creek which is not great uh, let's move on over here and the England England has landed on our shores that's nice can't click on them though ah the fox have been sieged down fantastic all right i would like to piece you out for war reps and breaking your alliance with who i don't think it matters if i break have him break his alliance with anybody i could make him break his alliance with the wichita try and get them into my federation and your rivalry get me some prestige break your alliance you know break no Keep the Padwatani, break your alliance with the Osaga. And how much money can I get? All of it? Nope. One, two, three, four. Uh, down, 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 down. Down two more. One, two. There we go. 24 ducats. Breaking a load of his alliances. Actually, if I don't break with the Wichita, I can get another... One, two. Get another other twenty something some ducats. Let's go with that. I need I need some more money. We'll go we'll take the money, break the Osaga break his alliance with the Osaga. Hopefully they'll start infighting and we'll see how that goes. Alright. Peace it out. The fox. And the siege on my capital has been relieved. Fantastic. So now we just gotta siege down some more of them. There's just the creek, the chair the um, Chickata and uh, who else am I at war with? Padwatani. Uh, oh, the Osaga. Also the Osaga. So, yeah. If I can get some of these guys out, some more of these guys out of the war, that'll be fine. I'll just sit. I'll, I'll just. My war exhaustion is going to be super high. Luckily, I don't have, like, any rebel problems. 
um, normally, so we should be good on that front. Padawatani is sieging down more of me. The Huron are going to try and fight. And they are going to get trashed because there's going to be three armies there. Uh, hopefully I can piece, I can siege down the Padawatani without too much trouble. My leader has no siege. Okay. Yeah, Huron's going to get wrecked here. Soex is coming down. Hope maybe they'll siege something down. I won't win this. I don't really want to fight these guys. I would rather just piece them out. I don't have the manpower to f actually fight them. It, it'd be better for me to siege them at down and piece them out. There's a big army there on the Soex. And the Shawnees not looking too great. Let's see. Shawnees at medium. War exhaustion. I'm at medium. They're all at high. All I really need to do is just siege down these two guys and then peace out before I lose my allies and hope preferably before I just go so deep in debt that doesn't matter I still have my capital though which is good England is just hunting for the seven cities of gold I need you to go and siege down Osaga Fox is not rivaling Osaga, unfortunately. Are you... No, you're not going to siege him down. I wish you would. This, uh, Chikta is, my, is the war leader. I'm now at high uh, or low war exhaustion. Yeah, things are not looking well for me. Not, not very well at all. If I can keep the Huron... If the Huron stay in... If these guys get pieced out and the Hurons stay in, and I can piece out two of their guys, I think I'm going to be good. Uh, you want me to give land? I decline. I have two stability, so even if they start stab hitting me for peace, I think I'll be okay. I mean, a real problem is going to be manpower and money, probably. We're getting there, though. Slowly but surely, we are working our way there. Oh, you're going to start sieging, unsieging some of my stuff. That's fine. We've lost, like, all of our prosperity. We're going to be heavily devastated. This is just a very costly war. Yeah, devastation everywhere. Osaga is the only one that's not really devastated. And Huron's still in prosper prosperity. Hope this war ends up being worth it. But if some of my stuff gets pieced out and war scores go down, then I think we'll be good. Soix, Huron. Yeah, they're sieging me. Unsieging me, which is good. If you want to come and fight me, I will be okay with that, because I think I can take you on. Definitely want to shift consolidate if you do, though. Where are you going? Alright, so you're going to go and siege down my land again. That's fine. Oh, you're not. Okay. Um, You are probably going to get pieced out here, so it's very soon now that you're completely sieged down. That is unfortunate because you've got quite a large army. But now they are all splitting up, so we'll see if they reform or not. Huron is moving down here. Ooh, Portugal's here now as well. Fantastic. All the colonizers are coming. Looks like there's going to be a fight there. They're moving down, so the Huron might be able to pull through this fight, which would be nice. Come on, Huron. Beat the Patwatani. You've got a slight advantage, but you're rolling horribly. What is that? Like, constant zero? Holy cow. That is really bad. That's a that's a good roll. You got there are reinforcements coming in on both sides. The sixth, the ninth. Oh, nope, they lost, and now the other guys come in to fight. It's just a dog pile now. Um what was that? Oh, they got pieced out. Okay. Well that's not good. Soix has been pieced out, and they have lost land. It's not good. I may give it back to them. 
in this war. I don't know if I will be able to or not. But now it is just me and the Huron, and the Hurons come to Tiari. Hopefully soon I'll be able to peace out Potawatani. Um, and the Shawnee have just been pieced out as well. So now it is literally just me and the Huron, and the guys the Huron are hiring, have hired. Should be able to get the Potawatani out of here relatively quickly though, hopefully. All right. Yeah, I have troops said to set to join me, but I'm getting sieged down. So this might have been a very I, bad look. Looking back on it, back several weeks ago when I first did this war, it was a very bad idea to do this war. I should have just waited for more guys to show up, but I got bored of waiting. So now I'm in this situation where I'm getting sieged down. Yep, it's not fun not fun at all um you're still you're not allied to me anymore that is unfortunate you are still in my federation though that's the good part um more of my land getting sieged down again these guys have just been sieged down i want to right, i want to move out of here before i piece them out because i don't want to get black flagged so we'll be out of there on the ninth. Okay, let's go ahead and piece these guys out. Take war reps. You can end your rivalry. You will no longer be allied to the Cree. And I can take money. How much? Looks like I can take 42 ducats. All right. Piece you out. You are moving up to Ohio. I think we'll be. I think we want to fight Osaga here. Um, you're not being sieged down, are you? No. All right. Uh, I don't want to cross that river. So the 25th, 25th. Wait one day. We'll move in, and then I want to kind of pincer them between me and the Huron. So the creek are now sieging me down. I want to see if I can catch him in a certain place. Let's see. He'll be on there on the 6th, the 12th. Um, I think we're good to do that. Yeah. No river crossing. Um, actually, no, there's a river crossing there. His got four maneuver. I've got five maneuver, so I will not take the river crossing. And I'll see if I can smash up the Osaga a little bit. Nope. Yeah, if you're going to piece them, if you want to siege them down, if they want to come up here to try and help before... Um, that would be great, but looks like they're not going to. We can siege down the Osaga. That's good. Then go and siege. So I'm probably going to go work on sieging these guys down. And we lost. Nuts. Really? That stinks. Ooh. Yeah, let's go smash that, uh, let's go smash that cavalry, shall we? Then I think I'm going to siege down. Oh, what? What? No, I got stack wiped. Come on. All right. What do you got? What do you want? You want me to give land to stuff. Right? Okay, so return cores. That's not happening. But I did just get stack wiped, which is really bad. I trained one unit. That that was that was not ex I did not expect that. Oh nope, I'm gonna be sieged down here, so I'm not gonna get that unit, am I? Oh great. Well, it looks like I'm gonna be giving in to their demands. Really, my because my morale was that low, I just got stack wiped. Let's see, what can I give them?
Let's see. So... Lots of war score. So war reps. Concede defeat. Um, cannot concede defeat with other stuff. Hold on. Clear offer. I will concede defeat. Nope. To be part of... Chikata requires this to be part of the deal offer. Really? Really? You don't just accept a concede defeat? Come on. Oh, bugger. You want to humiliate me? Does not want part of this offer. So, let's see. If I return that, it is not enough. Uh, I don't think there's anything I can do. I, th I think I'm going to lose like half of my land because I was an idiot in declaring this war. Let's see. Um, da da da, Chikta. They are offering the following terms. So they will. So we give cores. We give the three cores back to the creek. Cherokee will be forced to give 10% of our income and war reps, and we pay 50 ducats. Um, I really don't want to, but I think I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to lose a war. I'm gonna have to lose these land. Uh, I should still keep my cores, so we can just take it back later. But I think I'm gonna have to abandon this land. Oh, that's got my diplo rep building in it. Bugger. Boogers and kumquats. Is it the same thing? I think it's the same thing. I'm gonna have to take this, aren't I? Fine. I accept. Not happy about it. I'm very not happy about it. I don't have my cores anymore. Poop. Butter and biscuits. So what I get for attacking so many guys. Not happy. And at the moment, I'm going to lose my federation as well. I'm really not happy. Let's finish this colony up. Finish this colony up. Make money. I need to rebuild my army. I have a province. Oh. Numpty, numpty, numpty. Alright. I'm very much not happy with this outcome. We're going to have to figure out a way to fix this. But that's going to happen in the next episode. Trading in tobacco has happened to us. Yeah, that's going to happen in the next episode. Hopefully we'll get some Europeans coming up here soon. Um, I was working my way up to Chesapeake, I believe. Yeah. So I think we'll continue the journey up to Chesapeake and yeah we're gonna be slow again it's gonna be slow again but I think I'll do a couple more episodes and then see where we end up but yeah I think that's gonna be it for this episode guys unfortunately we've lost our first war it happens sometimes but yeah uh, I want to thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you all in the next one till then guys bye bye